Hi you guys, it's a new day and I am about to get my extensions put back in. My hair is pretty long right now. I just finished a Pilates class, but um, I'm gonna get a trim because look at how dead this is. Like, oh, dead. I'm just gonna get one row in for thickness just to help with like wedding hairstyles and it's just fun to have more hair to play with. And then Matt and I are getting married officially this Saturday. Freaking crazy. Um, since we're married in Mexico in July, we have to get like legally married in the States, so we decided to do that Saturday, which I'm so excited for. And then our friends are throwing us a couple's bridal shower, which will be so nice afterwards to celebrate. You guys saw my bridal shower this past weekend. It was amazing. I don't even think I talked about it. We can talk about it really quick. So my aunts and my cousins threw it in Chicago. It was so nice. So lovely to see all of them. A lot of them aren't able to make it to the actual wedding in Cabo. They want to be there obviously, but they just like can't. So it was nice to see them in person and celebrate my wedding with them. Um, Matt's mom was there. So that was great. My whole family. So my childhood friends, my old work friends from Leo Burnett, and it was great. Um, if you guys, I can put, well you guys saw my dress, but I'll add the picture I put up on Instagram. It's actually a two-piece set um, from, I'll, I'll link it down below if I can. So I'm planning on wearing the top again, and I'm just really excited for all of our bridal stuff happening, wedding stuff, and I have to redo my spray tan for this weekend. It's coming off, I look crazy, but. It is what it is. And then yesterday, I did a really fun photo shoot. I'm not gonna talk about it yet. Not because it's like a brand or anything, it's for me personally. I just don't wanna give too much away. Excited to get my hair done and just get this wedding going. Get married, finally. Matt and I have been together for a little over nine years, basically, so it's about damn time. All right, I just wanted to catch y'all up. I'm just hanging out in my car. I just did a Pilates class. And I really have to pee. Oh, I got my my girl coffee, but I got, they had nitro tea. This is nitro peach tea. There's like no sugar on it or anything, but it's like creamy. So good. All right, I'm gonna go. She just put in the row so you can see how thick. It's not colored yet. And like, it's clearly a different color, but she's gonna color it all. And this is what we're looking like. Twist it. Yeah. Iconic. Yeah. It's like, oh, life is so. You know when I have bobby pins down here? Because I do want to do a video with that, like, hair really quick. Where did you find that bobby pin? The second one in that little. All right, you guys. My hair is done. Let me show you in the mirror. All right. My hair is done. I am obsessed with it. Got the extensions and just updated the color. Did a little fun hairstyle, but I think it is so cute. Hair by Ruby on Instagram. Follow her, she's the best. And I'm obsessed. I'm so hungry, we're making tacos for dinner. Okay, it's the next day. Um, got my hair done, still, obviously. It's still but I just got an exciting package in the mail. So I got our guest book to sign, like, you know, when you go to a wedding, obviously. I used Artifact Uprising. Um, I just found them, like, I just Googled them. This is not, like, sponsored by them. But I want to film my first impression of it and just share with you guys if you guys are getting married. If it's good quality or not. It's packaged really nicely. I also paid for like expedited shipping because I want it for our couple's bridal shower this weekend in case we decide to bring it since a lot of those people can't come to the wedding. So, a little thank you know. It's packaged really cute. Oh my god, this is cute. Okay. So I got this like oatmeal color and then it just says the wards. I wanted something very simple. Um, and then on the binding, it says our date, July 15th, 2023. And it's really nice quality. I like the size too. All right, let's 
do it. Nice. I want you guys to be able to see a little more. Okay. Oh, nice and thick. Oh my gosh. So cute. They're really thick, like cardboard. You got this. <laughs> okay. Sorry. <laughs> Um, yeah, I really like how the pictures lay flat, like on the seam, so I can do like big pictures. They're just so pretty. These are our engagement shoot photos. Oh my gosh, look how cute. So much room to sign. We don't have a ton of people coming to our wedding, so I didn't feel like I needed like a ton of space, but because I wanted it to be like full, I didn't want like the first three pages to be full and then like people don't look at, at all of them. <sighs> look at these pictures of her. <laughs> Hi, Bucky. Look at you. You can tell when I'm a little upset. <sighs> um, so, just so many of her. <sighs> I forgot I did this. <laughs> Is this a shrine of Herman? Probably, but that was the last page, I think. Yeah. And this will just be like gorgeous coffee table decor and I just think it's really cute. And I love it. I'll link it down below if you guys are interested. Um, this is like really special. <sighs> I'm gonna wrap it back up so when Matt gets home we can look at it again. Like it's packaged so nicely. Losing a dog never gets easy, I will tell you that much. Please hug your puppers for me. I am in shock right now. We have our couple shower. Okay, we're getting married tomorrow in the courthouse, like our legal marriage. And then we're having like a couple shower party with our friends. And a baker on TikTok from Deliciousness Bakery, you guys should follow her, I'll put her down below, her Instagram and TikTok, reached out, she's local to Houston, and she was like, do you have any bridal events coming up? I would love to like make you a cake. I was like, perfect, we have this coming up. Would love to work together. Look at this. It's still in the box and I have to put it in the fridge because it's just, you guys. It's like the cutest color pink. I hope it's coming across correctly on camera. I sent her like inspo for what I liked and I was like, just married to be so cute because <laughs> We're just getting married, but I mean, how freaking cute is this cake? I need to put it in the fridge and then the inside it's cake batter. Oh my gosh, it is a work of art. But the whole thing doesn't fit in our fridge so I have to take it out, so I'm very scared, but I wanted to show you before I took it out because I am obsessed. I will have her link down below. You guys seriously, if you have any cake needs, she does a bunch of, she's a baker, so she has a bunch of different options. Stunning. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. This is how cute it was packaged. This is her logo. All the care instructions. Oh, I want to show you. Care instructions. Packaged so nice. So I'm going to save this and put it back in to carry it tomorrow. But. I mean, you guys. I'm obsessed. I can't believe I'm gonna be married tomorrow. In like 24 hours, oh my God. All right, someone else is here. I cannot get over it. 
Put it on our little Lazy Susan so you could see the whole. Look at the details. <laughs> receiving of rings, and by the joining of your hands. I therefore, by the authority of the state of Texas, pronounce that you're now husband and wife in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Matthew, make the tissue right. Woo! Hey 
friends. It's the next morning. This has been the craziest weekend, but I'm excited to look back at footage and see. I really tried to live in the moment though. And sometimes I meant like not bringing my camera, but I will try to insert clips and stuff from my phone where I can. But I, it is Memorial Day. I'm coaching right now. I'm gonna set up. I just got here. I still coach like one class a week. I just turn the TVs on. And get ready for our class. Oh, this is really hot. I don't want it to burn, you guys. Everything's really hot. Well, hello. It has been a weekend. I'll tell you that much. Um, I, it's Tuesday now. And I just got our marriage license filed. So it got signed. We got married this weekend. This weekend was like a blur. And by so fast, it was so much fun though. Like, oh, I'm obsessed. Also, I got this purse. I needed like a good white bag for bridal looks. I got this purse from Amazon and the you can take off this strap too. And it's like the cutest clutch. Um, highly recommend. It feels so soft. I'll have it in my storefront. I have like a whole bridal wedding folder in my storefront with like so many good items. So just letting you guys know that's there. Um, but I just got my marriage license file. Just casual. There is a spider on my windshield. Look. Is that good luck? I don't know. I, Matt actually hates spiders so that probably isn't good luck because I just got my marriage license filed and guys I say, I can say husband and my husband doesn't like spiders <laughs> my husband's a bitch <laughs> yeah it's been wild so right now I still have to get my nails done we leave for my bachelorette in two days it's Tuesday we leave on Thursday and I have to get my nails done so I just posted a TikTok sharing some examples on what to get just because it's more like real time whereas like this I have to edit and like whatever so follow me on TikTok if you're not already. Um, and then I am going to DSW right now because I did an online like pickup order. They're having 25% off over Memorial Day, like their friends and family sale. And I saw the cutest yellow Sambas. Um, if you guys, it's a very, 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 very trendy shoe right now. They're basically indoor soccer shoes. I used to wear them. I played indoor soccer for what, 18 years of my life. And they're coming back. But I only told myself I'm not gonna spend the money unless they're on like a crazy sale. And I got them for like 35, 40 bucks in a really cool colorway. So I just, I think it'd be a really cool look, which is like some jeans, a tank. Basically, what I'm wearing right now <laughs> jeans, tank, but right now I'm wearing just like these new balances. But if I had these Sambas, it could be a vibe. Okay, well, we're gonna go. I'll show you when I get them. And then I have to get my nails done because they are horrendous my hair is still going strong has a little curl left from when i got it done with my girl for the wedding i also post on instagram pictures from the courthouse we're saying courthouse it wasn't in the courthouse but like what else do you call it like a civil ceremony but like it's so texas i think i already explained it it was like a dance hall it was iconic if you are getting married in texas and you want the information of where we did it it was that I could not recommend it more. DM me and I will give you the information. All right, let's go get these shoes. Just got out of DSW and I wanna show you the shoes I got. Prefacing with, remember, these are indoor soccer shoes I am aware. I myself have played soccer for my entire life, basically. Um, but I found this colorway really fun and, and these babies. <laughs> They're not for everyone and I know that. And honestly, I love them. I just think they're like a nice fun pop. This with like jeans and a white tank. Stunning. Um, they came with yellow laces and white. I put the white on. Um, size down. I sized down half a size. But I got these on um, like mega sale at DSW. I'll link them down below. And then even though I did an online order, I thought I was doing so well. I'm like, I'm not going to buy more than I need. I looked into the clearance section of shoes and I thought these would be fun for 
just bridal looks because I'm doing a lot of white. My bachelorette's coming up, a combo. A lot of beachy, all white summer vibes. And I saw these shoes and I just thought they were so fun. It's like a bright orange kitten heel, which is comfortable. Um, but it's this nice like little cage. It covers my wide foot. My foot looks really good in it, which if you have wide feet, you know the struggle. And they were like 20 bucks on sale. Originally like 80, I think. But they had like a clearance price and then it was like money off the clearance price. So got these and then I was in line and they had just a little more like sticky boobs. I always need more of these little nipple covers. Um, so got that too, but I am gonna wear these. I feel like all white outfit, like an all white linen outfit, which is like a cute little pop of these orange. Yeah, originally 80, they're on sale for 49, but then it was like additional on top of that. So they're like 20 bucks. So I was smart with my shopping. Um, what else do I have to do? I have two. I have some returns I have to make. I bought Matt a bunch of stuff from Abercrombie, the last sale they had. Um, and I just bought a bunch of stuff and then I'm gonna return. What you didn't? Oh, I have to make this revolve return. Shoot, I didn't do that. Um, but then I also have this Abercrombie return. So I have to go to UPS for this. Got this like for Love and Lemons dress. It just wasn't the vibe. Wasn't it. So I'm gonna do that. Go to Abercrombie. And I'm just getting a lot of just annoying errands off my list, which is good. And then Matt just texted me saying he has a suit fitting tomorrow. We're doing custom suits for the guys. And so Matt got his like first run and it wasn't, there's some things we wanted to change. So he's going in tomorrow. I also have my second dress fitting tomorrow at 11 a.m. So big day for us. Obviously he's not coming with me to the dress fitting, but I will go to, with him to the suit fitting. Oh, also I got, I, this morning I had a TSA pre-check, my like interview or whatever, where I had to go in and they show my passport and whatever. And I got approved. So I have TSA pre now for the next five years, it's like 70 bucks. Super easy. I just went on the Staples website, like Staples, like the office supply store, and they have like how to do it all there. Did that today, and now I'm gonna run some errands. FedEx and Abercrombie. Let's get it. I just left them all doing my Abercrombie returns. Switch to Arm and oh. Hammer toothpaste. I, of course, bought more shit. Hi, friends. We are, it is. The next day, I'm so tired. It's Wednesday morning. I leave tomorrow for my bachelorette. Still haven't gotten my nails done. Um, I'm going back and forth. I just don't know what I want. I think I might do French tip with chrome. Today's a busy day though. So right now it is 8 a.m. I'm going to my Pilates class. Pilates class, I'll just read you my schedule because I have it all written out and time blocked because I'm crazy. Okay. 8.30 a.m. Pilates. It's currently 8.10. Then I have my second dress fitting at 11 a.m. So they have everything there. I need to just bring like in my shoes. And I don't think I'm gonna wear any shapewear because just the way my dress is, it's hard to find one. I bought a Skims version of shapewear and it just like, it wasn't it. Okay, so that's at 11 a.m. Then at noon, I have a nail appointment. Then at 1.30, Matt has his final tux, or suit fitting then i'm gonna go with him just to make sure because like I, I think i said this like i'll speak up <laughs> then later tonight i have to finish packing well i have to start packing i have everything i kind of laid out and i have a lot of stuff for my girls um but i'm trying to figure out the best way to bring it because i don't want like a lot of extra just suitcase space i saw someone on tiktok like check a cardboard box with bachelorette stuff like decorations and stuff i'm not bringing decorations i'm just bringing like just like fun samples for the girls to take, but I'm gonna give it to them and they can have it. I don't, I'm not gonna bring it back. Just like a lot of random like PR stuff I just put together and then I got some brands to scent and stuff as well. But yeah, oh no, my battery's blinking. I should go get run in and get a new one. Okay, bye. Done with Pilates. I just ran home, body showered quickly. Change I'm wearing. Let me see if you can even see. Just this white, like, $5 tank from Target. My Abercrombie Curve Love jeans, and then my new Adidas shoes, which look funny right now, but. Um, and then I am starving, but I don't have time, I didn't have time to eat, and I don't wanna be late. So I got a protein shake and a banana. Not ideal, 
but you know, I want to get protein after my workout. I'm, I actually am really hungry, so I'm hoping I can like get lunch sometime between now and then. I found this playlist on Spotify. I'm turning 30 this year, right? Born 93. I might be older than you, younger than you. Actually, let me know. How old are you? I love nostalgic music. I'm like in my era of nostalgic, nostalgic music, like Taylor Swift, Hannah Montana High School Musical. So I found this playlist called After School Club. It's a late picture of Hannah Montana. And it's like The Climb by Miley Cyrus, What Dreams Are Made Of, Hilary Duff, Breaking Free, High School Musical, He Could Be The One, Hannah Montana, just takes you back. Like this song, just in general. Hey now, hey now. I have my wedding shoes and my veil with me as well. So let's go try on a dress. We're here. You guys, I just did my second dress fitting. It looks so good. I'm so happy. This is such an exciting time. So many just like good things are happening and I'm just trying to like soak in every moment and really just live in the moment. I don't know, the, the Bachelorette group chat, it's going crazy. Everyone's so excited. Um, I have one more dress fitting end of June. So like before the wedding, I get to take it, take her home with me end of June. Crazy, who would have thought? End of last year, worst time of my life. <laughs> and I would say, this past month has been the best, some of the best months of my life. So, I mean, it gets better. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna get my nails done. I think what I'm leaning towards, well, let's check TikTok and see what people, what y'all are saying. I think I'm gonna do per chrome French manicure. Um, it looks like this. I don't know if you can even tell. It's a, it's basic, but I don't wanna do anything too crazy. I'm not a crazy gal. We'll see, okay. Let's go get my nails done. I just finished at the nail salon. I got chrome, wait, French with just a chrome on top. So really fun, still like within my comfort zone, nothing too crazy, but I think they're really cute. I don't know if you can even tell, but they just look like extra shiny, which I love. And then I stopped by Matt's fitting for his suit had some exchange or like final tweaks to make and now I'm heading home because I'm starving. So hungry. I think I'm gonna make some ground turkey tacos. So let's go. Okay, just got home. Made some ground turkey with some salsa and taco seasoning. Have some little tortillas with some cheese. I just made a quick guac, snacking on some fruit. And that's what we're having. Also some cottage cheese. Just been loving it. Good morning, you guys. I just woke up in Montauk with Matt. <laughs> um, and I wanna show you the house that we're staying at. My friends decorated, it's so cute. And I'm just like obsessed. Okay. So this is our room. It looked way cuter, but we just woke up. It's the first full day. You come in here and they have all these pictures of us. How do I make this brighter? These are like my college best friends. Look at these, we were in the sorority. We are in the sorority, my brother, my mom. Freshman year spring break. There's so many good memories here. This is our first picture together, it's so funny. All of these. Literally me as a freshman, just in a nutshell, that. So, so cute. <laughs> I'm obsessed. Hi, Matt. Ew. Me. We are Cosmo and Wanda. Um, okay, I guess I can quickly show you who's on the trip. So, where's like a good, decent picture? Okay. So, me. Nug, her name's Christine, but we call her Nug because she's very tiny, as you can see. And then Carolyn, we were all like attached to the hip, like best friends. 
roommates live together. Um, this is Belton. She's one of my bridesmaids. She's not here. This is a horrible picture. Here's another good picture. Here's a good picture of all of us. Okay. Alright, so Belton is one of my bridesmaids. Carol's one of my bridesmaids. Fogel's one of my bridesmaids. Um, and then Nug and Rachel. This is Rachel. One of my friends from Leo Burnett in Chicago. And then Nug was our other best friend from school. So yeah, but let me show you around. Alright, you come in. There's these little penis things. First off, this cute ass. It's so nice. Let me just show you around. We have this black suburban that we rented to drive from Montauk or from New York to Montauk. Okay, so you come in. There's this beautiful tree. There's like this little deck. You walk in. All this cute little picnic tables. They have all these string lights that were on last night. Projector, so cute. Okay, you have all these wieners. Come in here, kitchen, so cute. And then this is where, it was really cute last night, but we like already messed it up, but yeah. <laughs> There's Matt, some shambongs. You guys, they got me this Dior pair of earrings. I'm whispering because everyone's still sleeping. They're stunning. I'm obsessed. So cute. And those little stickers of, of Matt. We have the misses. There's like another loft. This little area. And yeah. It's so cute. Um, okay. So today we're going to the winery. I'm so excited. I. I'm gonna try to get clips on my phone. I'm not bringing my camera just because I don't want to be responsible for it. And but guys, I'm having the best time and I'm so happy. Also, I got my nails on. Did I show you this? I got chrome French. Okay. So I got some products from some of my favorite brands for my girls as a thank you. So we got some Dose Wellness liver shots. I, you guys know I love these. I always have them in my fridge. Then a makeup mirror to travel with, some AG1, um, their athletic greens, some of these pimple patch star faces, La Roche Posay sent some sunscreen, battle proteins, electrolyte packets. Okay. Battle proteins sent some electrolyte packets and some just collagen. These eye masks are great. Hair ties from Amika and just some travel products. So I set that up for the girls. They literally got me Dior. So, um, yeah. So the least I can do. Woo! Makeup. Sure. Matt saw this and goes, nice beer pong table. I'm like, of course you think that. And our makeup out here. How cute. It's my outfit for dinner. So cute. And there's a deer in our backyard. So much fun. But, oh, okay. The skirt is from O'Malley. What is it? O'Malley? It's not O'Malley. Molly? Can't remember. Tank is just a five dollar Target tank. And I have heels. I'm so excited getting ready for dinner. Drinking. Vibes are so good. So he has a little intro. Oh, I think. Oh, he's an Hello, ladies. Oh. I hope you're having fun on the Hamptons. That's too much fun. 
Blair will send me some questions I've got to answer about Blair or about our relationship. Let's we'll see if I get these right. You gotta send me the video of Blair when you're done. Aww. Let's get right into it. Oh, you read it. Where's your favorite place to eat out together? Uh oh. We love Asian food, like dumplings, like Wanabao. Our favorite place to eat out together in Houston, we haven't been in a while. Wanna I'm gonna go with Wanabao. Yeah! Okay. Rid of one piece of your clothing, what would it be? If, oh, if you could get rid of one piece of his clothing, mm. what would it be? Okay, I feel like it might be like Crocs. Oh my god, yes, Josh has Crocs. But I like, Crocs. yeah, he has like camo Crocs. But I'll wear them for oh like convenience gosh. and I'm right like, You love them, but you hate them. Yeah, but also like a lot of his fishing shirts. It's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Probably all my fishing shirts. <laughs> I said that oh! Summer because it's so damn hot down here. This one. I just got it. Oh my god, he's so good. I'm not kidding. Why is he Is that a new one? Not those. Probably. Oh! 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 What is one habit so... that Blair finds the most annoying about you? Oh! oh okay. I think oh, I know the answer to this one. Wait, because most he... annoying about him? Yeah. Oh, okay. He... Yeah, okay. That he. Will like say he's gonna do something like, <laughs> oh yeah, like I'm gonna do that, and then he like puts it out to like the last minute. Okay. Um, I'll probably just answer that later. What? <laughs> just kidding. My oh, it's no! off. For sure. Procrastination. Procrastination. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So good. Oh my god. So good. What? You're like. When did you know that you fell in love with Blair? I wrote. He was. We were still long distance. He was taking the train up to Chicago from St. Louis to like visit me on the week weekends and stuff. And I dropped him off at the train station. He was like getting out of the car and he looks at me and he goes, I love you. And he like kisses me and he runs off because he's like Aww. not good with like emotions. Aww. And he's like, I love you. And he like ran off. And I'm like, what the fuck just happened? He like kissed me and like ran off and caught the train. And I was like, wait, there was like a movie. Yeah, was, like, a movie. movie. We like see each other in the, like through the window. <laughs> to Chicago when she took me around to all the we did all the touristy things she put together this little brochure with like oh my God. pictures and little fun facts and um it was like my first real official trip to Chicago and then I said I love you right before I got on the train to go back oh <laughs> are you kidding me <laughs> did you guys talk before I know I got some of those right hopefully you guys have a good time um uh, send me the video when you're done and I'll see y'all in Cabo yeah He was honestly the best guy for doing that. That was <laughs> like, think about a recording. And oh my god. I love you so much. That's so cute. That was so cute.